It's good to take life inventory once in a while. A mirror is a great tool for us all to do that. It reflects back the things we like about ourselves, as well as some of the things we don't. It can help us deal with those funny things called emotions, like happiness, sadness, and anger. Confession time. Before becoming America's surrogate educational father, I'd originally desired to become a minister. I'd grown tired of the suffering in the world. I'd been given many unusual gifts, but struggled to find a safe place for their employ. Evil had become pervasive, the weak were preyed upon, and although our Creator is a being of mercy, He is also a being of justice. Some of the gifts I'd been blessed with were a merciful heart. But that's all I have. Help! Courage. Oh, we got five, we got ten. We a got sound of mind. What are you looking at? You boys have two options. One, you put the purse down and walk away on your own two feet. Or two, we'll take option two. Not to mention a deadly right hook. No, 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 I don't want any trouble. Go home, boys, and never partake in evil again. Get out of the guy's crazy. Thank you. Hey, buddy, I got an opportunity for you. After years of searching, I thought I'd finally found my true calm. <laughs> I meet a man that doesn't hit like a little bitch. I was going to say the same thing, minus the swear word. The name's John Friday. My name is Mr. Rogers. I'm sorry. It would appear that I was in a frightful daze. We just wanted to let you know that we'll be prepped on set in five minutes. Thank you. I'll be ready. Are you sure about this? Serve our country and vanquish evil around the world? Absolutely. You're fucking crazy, man. You're going to bankrupt me. Don't worry, it'll go to something nice, I promise. But for now, it stays in the swear job. Just remember your training. If you lose your focus, use your imagination. Make believe you can do it if you have to. Okay. Thank you. I needed that. What's your name? Samuel Tuesday. Tuesday and Friday. What are my chances? Guess that makes you Wednesday. Or Thursday. I think Rogers is fine for now. For the next few years, we were inseparable, the three of us. We attacked the enemy like we were the hammer of the Almighty. kills in any covert operation force in American history. It wasn't all bloodshed. We had good times, too.
<laughs> but one thing you'll learn as you age is that life is like the pendulum on a clock. No matter what your fortune is now, it will swing the other way. Eventually. Rogers, glad you made it back. At least one of you did. Excuse me, Commander McFeely, what are you... Tuesday and Friday. Think they've been taking POW. We were only separated for a minute. That's all it takes. When's the extraction operation commencing, sir? Extraction? Are you out of your fucking mind, Rogers? <laughs> are you out of your mind, Rogers? It's too risky. We can't leave them out there, McFeely. Someone has You'll to You'll do help. what I fucking... I'm not one of your sidekicks, Rogers. You'll do what I tell you to. You hear me, Rogers? You'll do what I say! I'd left them for only a few minutes, and this was the result. The guilt. The guilt was immense. I commissioned the assistance of a local to take me to where I believed they'd been taken. It cost me a bit, but luckily I had enough. I wouldn't have made it without you. What's your name? I'm Trolley. Trolley. I like that. Can I get an IOU? <laughs> this won't make Feely very good. help you Tuesday. We're going to get you back. It's over, Rogers. Leave me. Kid, quick, kid. Kid! You made me believe I can make a difference. And I did. I did. I'm ready for you now, Mr. Just give me a minute, please. Sorry. We can't leave you. You're our partner. You're our ally, you're our friend. I'm more than that. I'm your... I'm your neighbor. Won't you please? Won't you please? Please be mine.
Tuesday's last words taught me that there was a better way to deal with anger. It wasn't about being a fellow soldier, or fighter, or even a friend. It was about being courteous and kind to strangers around you. It was about being a neighbor to those that didn't have one. A short time later, I resigned. My service records were destroyed at my request and I started over. It was time to apply my talents to those who could benefit the most. Not just adults looking for inspiration, but young minds full of potential, capable of averting the wars that destroy the very fabric of humanity. I taught Tuesday to make believe he could be brave. Could education be the answer? Could knowledge Could it be possible to make believe ourselves into a better world? The time had come to shape young hearts and minds for good. To instill friendship, love and kindness into my fellow man. To once again become neighbors. Quiet on set, roll sound, roll camera. And action. Hello, neighbors. It's a beautiful day in this neighborhood. A beautiful day for a neighbor. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? Please, won't you be my neighbor?